In this DVD, we feature the sixth section of our Corver Coaching six-part session planner, Home Assignment, a small but important segment for young players. Toe taps, a step on slide and turn 90 degrees. The coach demonstrates, sole inside of the foot and turn. The boys moving forward in formation, always aware of a teammates beside them. They maintain the distances between them while showing perfect technique. The beginning of the half pull spin turn that can be so effective under pressure in the game. Toe taps across the grid and a single slide. The coach demonstrates with a confident and precise touch. Now the boys with the left foot only across the grid. And now the right foot to return. Toe taps across the grid with a double slide using both feet. Pulling the ball back with the sole and pushing it forward with the inside helps them to advance smoothly. Toe taps. A double slide with the soles and turn 180. A smooth change of direction with the ball under complete control and the attacker prepared for any challenge. Soul, soul, turn. Toe taps. A double slide behind the standing leg and turn 180. Ball manipulation like this not only makes for an excellent turn, but can confuse and freeze opponents and delay their challenge. Toe taps, forwards and backwards, over the ball with complete control. This may seem like a simple action, The ability to move forwards and backwards, perfectly balanced over the ball and maintaining complete control, takes practice. Inside cut. Not only is the ball being cut and redirected, but the attacker's body is placed in a strong shielding position between the ball and the opponent.
outside cut, a move that takes good flexibility and touch. The same as the inside cut, only using the outside of the foot. Reach and cut the ball in the opposite direction with only one touch if possible. The coach asks the players not to overrun the ball and take more steps than necessary, but to reach as far as possible to save ground, cut the ball with one touch and move the body into a shielding position for a controlled getaway. The slap cut. Slap the ball alongside the body in the direction of the run, then immediately cut the ball with the outside of the foot in the opposite direction. This is most effective when the player fakes to strike the ball in one direction, then takes it in the other. The young player isn't quite selling the strike yet, but it will surely come with practice and confidence. The twist off. Cutting the ball with the inside of the foot, then twisting off to make a three-quarter turn. The first cut, moving the ball in the direction the player wants to go. With practice, one touch and some speed will make this an excellent game skill. The outside twist off. Cutting with the outside of the foot. It takes good ankle flexibility and some courage for young players learning this move. More difficult and intimidating than the inside cut, but another valuable technique. The scissors. Step around the ball as if to take with the outside of the foot, but take it in the opposite direction with the outside of the other foot. Stepping low around the ball to cover it up momentarily and sell the fake, freezing the opponent for a second before driving away. Faking to go one way and going the other. The double scissors. Step around the ball with both feet this time before taking away with the outside of the first foot. Again, a good move to freeze opponents, keeping the feet low around the ball when possible 
to the most effective move. Scissors step over. Step around, step over as if to strike and take away with the outside of the step over foot. Step around, step over and take away. Scissors hop. Step around, tap and take away. Step around, tap and take away. Yeah. It can be done taking the ball yeah. forward or a good option behind the standing leg. The side step, fake to take with the outside of one foot, then take in the opposite direction with the outside of the other. Fake right, then go left. Double side step, fake to take with the outside of both feet, then take in the original direction. Ideally, short quick steps and a fast getaway. Left, right, left. Step over. Turn the knee and hip of the step over foot as if to strike and sell the fake but step over the ball and take it in the opposite direction with the outside of a step over foot. Double step over. Step over with both feet, then take away with the outside of the first foot. Slap step over. Slap across the body, step over with the other foot, and take with the outside of the step over foot. The pull through step over. Step over. Pull through with the trailing foot and take with the outside of the step over foot. Step, drag, push. The drag push. This move is best done when stationary or at a slow jog. Drag with the inside and push outside with the outside of the foot. Reverse drag push. Drag inside. Fake to push with the outside of the same foot but take in the original direction with the outside of the other foot. Again, this move is best done when stationary or at a slow jog. The whip. Roll the ball across the body with the outside of the foot 
then quickly tap it back with the toe. Outside, inside. As with all the moves, it will improve with practice. V-drag push. Pull the ball with the sole across the body, push back in the same direction with the inside, then push outside with the outside of the same foot. Pull, drag, push. Inside push fin. Push the ball in front, then reach and cut with the inside of the foot. Push the ball with the inside, then hook in a different direction with the toe. Push and cut. Slap push. Slap the ball across the body with the sole, then push it in the opposite direction with the outside of the slap foot. Slap, hop, push. We end this home assignment segment with some ground juggling skills. They are a good example of what can be done alone with a ball and a little imagination. They're also demanding physically and can only be done for limited periods. But they develop leg and core strength along with excellent ball control and coordination. Mastering them will put you in some elite company
This ends our Session Planner DVD series, featuring our pathway to soccer excellence. To find out more about Corver Coaching, go to corver.com and watch out for our new DVD series coming soon.